Welcome to Kitty Plays Morrowind. I am Nighty, the Black Panther Kitty, and I'll be the host for your episode. Last time when we left off, we were heading to Aldrun, we nearly didn't find it, and we were on our way to Gnesis to finish the Pilgrimage of the Seven Graces. So, let's load the game. <sighs> How does the spiffing Brit say it? every time. If you don't know him, you should watch him. The infinite wisdom of Todd Howard. Loading screens in Bethesda games. Well, in Morrowind they were a little bit faster than in the later games. So here we are. And yes, I'm aware that I have a little bit of lag. Here we are in the glorious Mages Guild, if I remember correctly. Yes, the blue light already shows it. We left off in the Mages Guild. We are in Aldrun, and this means I, my self-set rules now allow me to fast travel here. And let's head outside. There is a bit of a storm, I must warn you. Last time we left off on a little sandstorm outside. This is also why I nearly missed the city. And again, the loading screens. And ba bam, magic! Well, I didn't make it, but again, the infinite wisdom of Todd Howard, as the spiffing grid would put it, the storm is just gone. Well, that's what happens when you load an area. And it might just start again any second. Anyhow, we were going to head over to Knesis. Let me real quick check where we were. So we are, it should be this one. Yes, Stronghold of Baranda, south of Knesis. Perfect. So this is where we want to go. This is where we are. So let's just head over. Something seemed to have fallen down right now. Seems like the Silk Strider burps a lot. Well, maybe it's how they communicate. So a thing that I did compared to last time, or a thing that I did no, that's going to the south. We want to go to the north, please. The thing that I did is, uh, in order for us to not miss all the side quests that we chose not to do, um, I actually made a little list, which I failed to include into OBS. I, I did try, but it just won't display. And... Um, yeah, so, so we can check check them off. I can't show them to you. Sadly, I actually formatted them with a nice, nice more windy font and stuff like that, or a nice uh, handwritten font and stuff like that. But no, I, I can't show it to you. OBS won't let me. I will figure out a way to do this for the next recording session. And also, it's been quite a while since I played last, so I'm talk going to talk to her. Make it quick, I Outlander don't remember if I did last time. I don't think so, because my journal has just been updated. Please, can't you help me? My husband and I were traveling through here and we were attacked by a pack of wild nick sounds. Well, good lady, good for you that you met me. I think I'm going to take care of these wild nick sounds. The way at last three of them, they seem to come out of nowhere. My husband, Trevor and Aaron tried to fight them off, but they were too much for him. And he was forced to flee. I tried to play dead in hopes the hounds would find no sport in me. I just hope I can find Dreryl before the hounds come back. I'm going to look for your husband. Don't worry, ma'am. You're willing to do that? Thank you so much. I'm sure he didn't go too far, because the hounds seem to have heard him. If I remember correctly, he ran off into the west, but in all the confusion I can't be sure. Well, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm going to find him, so... This is a little fetch quest. I think we're going to going to do this. I do hope that we're up against the challenge with the Nick sounds. So directly to the west, of course, is the city. 
but maybe they are talking about this place here. Let me just get my magic sorted out. So two was attacking, three was healing, four was the shield, and one is the weapon for when I'm all out of juice. So I'm going to, of course, drop my frame rate a lot by attacking this armor and fail to cast spells. Well, that's what happens if you're still a noob in spellcasting. Happens in pen and paper games also all the time if you're a noob at spellcasting. Well, it seems like uh, this is me heading west. It seems like this is... Okay. You witnessed a very common thing with me, which namely is me being an idiot. I mixed up west and east. Perfect. I think I could, could apply for a job in the White House if I was an American. But I think I'm fit for the job, mixing up west and east and countries. I mean... Ugh. Who cares? It doesn't matter which country we bomb, right? <laughs> well, enough about politics. I don't want to talk too much about politics here. Especially these days, as it's such a depressing topic. Let me head straight to the east. Hopefully find the Nick sounds. There is a cliff race over there. Oh, we are not interested in him. There's lots of sounds. Which made me kind of jumpy. Well, I could try throwing in a healing spell. Oh, no, I'm being attacked. I'm not going to throw in a healing spell. Oh, a tasty rat. Well, let me shock you. Bye. My shocking appearance. See? And my destruction skill. Ah, still no meat. I'm so hungry. Well, anyhow. I'm really jumpy at the this is the atmospheric sound effects um, mod and also there's one thing that I complained about I, I, I did install a texture replacer a big one and I'm pretty sure that these textures are unloaded although or even though I installed the necessary graphics enhancer plugin so I currently don't know if everything is working correctly. It seems like the crown textures are correctly being replaced. I don't know. It's kind of weird and quirky. Yes, I know I'm going to the north right now. Well, that's the troubling thing with the side quests. You might not actually find where you need to go. Well, anyhow, we need to go to the west, that's what she said, and the road to, to Gnesis, I just noticed, takes us basically to the west of Aldrun, so maybe, maybe we'll just meet that person and just... Let me real quick... Yes, I know I'm, I'm walking a lot in these games and it takes a lot of time, but... Let me real quick check, I think she was over there in here and I was just walking the wrong way basically. I don't know. Let, let me just head over to Gnesis. I'm going to real quick open the open this or just drop a quick save in case the game crashes on me and open the one note that you sadly can't see and add a little note to um, find the husband west of Entrance to Aldrun. There we go. Back into the game. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> oh. <sighs> another, uh, another big tip from my side is never try to inhale your own spit. You should swallow, not inhale it. Also, I need to. I need to minimize one node so I can actually see OBS and see if someone of you actually writes something into the chat. And by someone of you, I actually mean the people watching currently in the stream as I'm live streaming this recording. So a big shout out to everyone who's watching me live. And also 
uh, let's say a little less big shout out to the ones watching this later because you can't participate live. Okay, let's head over to Gnesis. Let us check the map. Yes, we made next to little, next to no progress as the map seems to show us. I'm a little too. If I'm honest, I'm a little, little bit afraid of fighting three Nick sounds. I don't quite remember how strong we were, but I'm sure we were actually quite weak. So let me take on this red. This red is a rather easy target. I don't have enough magicka, no problem. This is what the restore magicka potion is for. And after this fight, I'm going to restore my health. Of course, I will. If I need to do it in the fight, I'm uh, in case that I am going to need a. And it's dead. Perfect. That's what I wanted to see. I could have created a shield. Of course, I could. But I might have mentioned it already. I'm kind of an idiot, and I forget things like this. Well, that's it. We're healed. Cliff Racer without something, at least some red meat. Let's eat it, because we're hungry. Well, of course, our magicka is being drained because of that, but nonetheless, we were hungry, and hungry cat must eat. That's very important. And hungry cat eats red. So there is fog out here. So, as I mentioned, I think I actually, it's kind of weird, I think I'm going the wrong place, or I just went, as I said, it's it's been like a month or something since I last, since I last played. Yeah, okay, I just went over to Aldrun just to basically get to where it is, and I think I have this nice fellow over here already on my list. Yeah, this is this is the naked guy. So this is the music stopped. Ah, Cliff Racer. I think I'm going to actually try doing this, uh, doing this little quest of his. Drop a quick save before it. Oh. Yeah, I the shield and now. Racer is down. And we found ourselves some racer plumes, which is very awesome. Okay, let me real quick heal the No, I'm not I don't want to take off a rope. I was clicking it a bit too fast. Did I mention that this game is rather old? I think I did. So I'm going to drop a little quick save and then show you the quest. So this naked guy here. Um, yeah, he is pretty pissed. You, you will speak with me now, or you shall feel the bite of my axe. When this enchantment wears off, Heisen Deep Raid will shed some blood. What kind of enchantment? I, a foul witch, has given me some enchanted disease, leaving me, leaving me rooted to the spot. She called it Witch Wither. Foul temptress. I have been her escort. She was a big woman, friendly, you know. Then the damned witch ensorcelled me, leaving me at this spot nearly naked to display my shame to the world. Highs and Deep Raid is not accustomed to being mocked, stranger. I shall paint the ground with her entrails. I can help you. I'll find you a potion that will cure your paralyzation. You have honor, Nighty. I'm a man of standing among my people. My father, and my father's father, and his father before him, have had songs, songs sung of their deeds, and I shall be no different. I distrust potions in general, but bring me one of, from a reputable alchemist. Release me from this bondage, and I will reward you. Then I shall cleave that whore in twain. Okay, he's, he's pretty pissed. 
Um, the thing I did remember is that he's going to follow me, um, but I think he's not going to do it right now. Um, can I ask him about the... Um, no. He's not going to take, tell me where the witch went. I know that a little bit down the road, but I don't know in which direction she actually is. And I think... I now believe that she will give me the antidote. And if I give it to him, then he will follow me. So this is basically where I came from, from Balmora. I wanted to go to Gnesis. And it seemed like I just made a little halt in Aldrun. And there is, there is three Nyx Hounds. Oh my god, this could be... This could be actually where the husband of that other woman ran off to. Let me see, do I have some weapon that I can use from a distance? No, only my trusty spells. Let's put a shield here. So much for trusty. But this time this worked. Let me recharge my magicka. And head over. Hello, Mr. New Sound. Well, as long as they don't reach me, it seems like I'm pretty safe. And I can pull them one by one, so... Since they are beasts, this doesn't count as murder. Else, I won't need them to actually hit me once. Before I hit them. By hitting, I mean making gotcha. one damage, because that's the infinite wisdom of uh, Todd Howard, as... I, you might notice that I like the spiffing bread. Well, that's uh, that's how this game mechanics work. The game basically doesn't know that you have been attacked unless you actually have taken damage from it. So let's head in this direction and maybe we'll find the husband that we promised to save. And which I accidentally looked for in the wrong direction. Let's see, there is nobody here. Let me check. Let me just real quick check over there. If we can find the husband. Of course, all this running will over time. No, this is just a road. Okay. All this running will over time make us faster. So we are indeed training ourselves. up for alchemy which I am again going to do out of the recording I might throw in a little alchemy lesson into the recording at some point I think I started doing alchemy in the recording earlier but when I'm better I'm going to just basically show off a little bit. Oh, come on, come on, take it. So just following this road. And one thing that I did not do, which I'm going to admit right away, is I did not write a list of topics to talk about during these long trips. I know that I already talk to you about the um, the drafting thing so I'm not going to tr try not to to you know tell the same anecdote twice so there is some things maybe some updates from from my normal life um, when I'm not re being recording I'm working in software so I'm, I'm a software engineer, I'm working in an engineering company. And basically what I'm doing there is called DevOps. The original idea of DevOps is that the software developers, the one who actually write the code, also do maintain the infrastructure of development. Oh, I him I didn't want to do this. No, not yet. Because because of this. Okay. 
when I kill the three hounds, I need to drop a quick save again. I need to get used to saving more often. Well, shield. This time it worked the first time and spark. I need to recharge the Magicka. When I'm fighting, I might be um, rather quiet because I'm actually pretty concentrated, even though the mechanics aren't that hard. But uh, I tend to not notice my health going down, for example, and just like I did in the last run. Can I hit him? Yeah. My spell works far enough. No, this was one too many, but on the other hand, it also caused me to learn destruction a little bit more. Oh, look at this happy music. Yeah. So yes, I am keeping a quest log beside the in-game quest log, because sometimes the in-game quest log doesn't show you Enough information. I can have enough magic to kill myself. Let's correct that. Didn't wait for the because this is teaching me restoration. And the reason why I'm not recharging immediately is it could be that I'm going that I that I go somewhere. Quick save. But I go somewhere and um, rest, and then I kind of wasted that potion. Hmm. So the thing that I actually wanted to to do was uh, drop my shield first. So I know that this Kaguti is waiting for me over there. While, while walking, <laughs> I might as well just rip every plant out of the soil that I can find. Not the soil that I can, every plant that I can find out of the soil. Yeah. English grammar is hard. It's kind of, kind of weird, I'm, I am German and it's hard for me to fake a German accent. That's kind of weird, isn't it? I think that just sounded more Russian than German, right? Well, I'm not good with accents anyway. So let me go and head and... Um, do this. Hi Blaze, I saw you in the stream chat. And I don't know the answer to your question, to be honest. I am actually pretty new to Twitch, so I don't know how most of the things in there work, but um, I again forgot to set the shield uh, spell on. Yeah. That's the one that I want to do. And now I know why I died. I tried to escape backwards against a stone. Note to self, there is a stone there. I'm sure I will forget that in five minutes. Anyhow, one more try before I end the episode. Uh, which button does what? I haven't played for so long. That's the shield, and that's the spark, and I need more magic. Uh, I need more... No, I'm not sneaking, I'm just walking slowly, so I'm actually... No, come on, failed casting the spell. Now it's time for a restore health potion. Restore... That one to fatigue, and... That one. Why won't you die? Uh -huh. 
Did I say last try? Uh, yeah. I don't know. I am determined and I only have one health potion. That's not a good situation to be in. But I don't want to run back and then go there again. I'm not... Oh, I'm, I'm probably not good enough at just sneaking past him. But I could try. So let's see, let's all be quiet. I'm pretty sure he will notice me. Yeah, he did. That was not so I, I failed casting the spell. Uh, I think I just died in a yep. I'm totally too weak to fight this. I'm going to try fighting this Kaguti with my uh, actual dagger, which would be kind of weird. Oh, wizard not fighting with spells, but yeah. Let's try this. And of course I want to have both when I do so. And the shield. And the shield. Because of course being correct correctly as a weather I'm not wearing any armor. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm not hitting. I only tried to hit once and I was spamming the left mouse button. Yeah, that's that's not how it works. So it seems like I need to go back and stuck stock up on health potions. And I'm actually going to do this outside of the recording. So next time we see each other I will be well not in the exact same position but around here and try attacking this guy again. So for all of us for all of those watching me on YouTube, I say bye bye and you will see the dice telling you how many days to wait until the next episode comes out.